American sea bass, with its flaky texture and rich, buttery flavor, is one of the most popular species of sea bass found in fine dining restaurants worldwide. But why is this fish so pricey, costing around $50 a pound, much more than most white fish? Let's dive into the fascinating reasons behind the high cost of American sea bass. Originally known as the Patagonian toothfish, this less common species found in South America and Antarctic waters wasn't always so sought after. Enterprising fish wholesaler Louis Langston coined the name American Sea Bass. In 1980, figuring diners would find the name more appealing than Toothfish Boy, was he right? The new name quickly gained traction and the fish's rich taste and versatility made it a household name in no time. American sea bass is renowned for its rich, buttery taste, similar to cod, and its tender, flaky texture. It's incredibly versatile, pairing well with various spice combinations and sauces. Remember the 1993 blockbuster Jurassic Park? This luxurious fish was featured, epitomizing the film's spare no expense theme. After the film's success, demand for American sea bass skyrocketed, pushing it close to the brink. The Pass on American Sea Bass. Campaign was then launched to encourage chefs and diners to give the species a break allowing its stocks time to recover. American sea bass, scientifically known as Desostichus elegenoides, thrives in the cold, deep waters of the southern ocean between Antarctica and the subantarctic regions. This fish is known for its large size, with adults weighing between 20 and 30 lbs, although some giants have tipped the scales at over 300 lbs. Living in the frigid depths of the ocean, American sea bass have a high fat content, giving them their distinctive rich, buttery flavor. Their habitat and living conditions significantly contribute to their unique characteristics making them a favorite in culinary circles. So what does it take to harvest American sea bass? Fishing in the Southern Ocean is no walk in the park. We're talking cold, rocky waters, strong winds, rough seas, and extreme weather patterns. Fishing vessels and crew members need special equipment and techniques to navigate these harsh conditions. American sea bass live at depths ranging from 200 to 15,000 feet, requiring complex and expensive gear like trawlers, long lines, and pots designed to withstand extreme ocean pressures. Navigating these waters isn't easy either poor visibility and unpredictable sea conditions make it a risky venture. Overfishing has long been a concern, pushing American sea bass to the brink. The Pass on American Sea Bass campaign and other conservation efforts have helped manage and protect these vital fish stocks. Legal and illegal fishing practices have added to the challenges, but many initiatives have been implemented to ensure sustainability. Legal fishing fleets adhere to strict catch quotas, size limits, and zone closures to prevent overfishing. However, illegal, unreported, and unregulated IUU fishing still poses a threat, 
with poachers often operating in remote areas outside national boundaries, making enforcement difficult. Organizations like the Commission for the Conservation of Antarctic Marine Living Resources, CCCAMLR, have developed conservation plans and fishing quotas to support American sea bass populations effectively. Monitoring and surveillance programs, including satellite tracking and vessel monitoring systems, help combat IUU fishing and enforce regulations. The Marine Stewardship Council MSC certifies sustainable American sea-based fishing activities, promoting responsible practices and consumer awareness. Collaborations among governments, NGOs, and industry partners are crucial in tackling illicit fishing activities and ensuring long-term sustainability. American sea bass is primarily caught using long lines, troll nets, or pots in deep, remote ocean waters. Once caught, the fish are immediately handled to minimize stress and maintain freshness. Advanced onboard processing techniques ensure the fish is quality before being transported to shore. After landing, the catch is transported to modern fish processing plants by refrigerated trucks or ships to maintain proper temperature conditions. At the processing plant, the fish undergo a rigorous inspection and quality control process. Any fish that doesn't meet safety and quality standards is discarded. The fish are then processed using advanced cutting techniques to fillet, portion, and pack them according to customer requirements. Automated filleting machines portioning machines, and vacuum packaging help maintain freshness and extend shelf life. The processed American sea base is then shipped by refrigerated trucks, ships, or air freight to domestic and international markets. Proper handling and storage techniques are crucial in preserving the fish's quality until it reaches consumers. American Sea Base is celebrated for its rich flavor and buttery texture, making it a favorite in upscale dining establishments worldwide. Its success in luxury markets is due to its unique culinary characteristics and scarcity. With a delicate, moist texture that appeals to discerning palates, American Sea Bass is delicious and relatively rare, enhancing its allure. Its limited availability further elevates its status as a premium product. Additionally, American Sea Base is a rich source of omega-3 fatty acids and high-quality protein, attracting health-conscious consumers willing to pay a premium for nutritious gourmet options. Demand for American sea bass is spreading to Europe and Asia, where affluent diners seek exotic, high-quality seafood options. American sea bass is known for its versatility as it can be prepared in various ways, from grilling in pans, searing to poaching and baking, allowing for various menu styles. Combining unique taste, exclusivity, health benefits, sustainability, global demand, and culinary versatility has resulted in high demand for American sea bass in luxury markets worldwide, particularly in upscale restaurants in the United States, Europe, and Asia. The reputation of American sea bass as a gourmet fish significantly affects its price in many ways. The gourmet status of the fish creates a sense of high value among consumers. 
The demand for American sea bays often outnumbers its limited supply, raising prices. Its success in upscale restaurants and luxury markets further increases this demand, increasing prices. American sea base is usually associated with exclusivity and luxurious dining experiences. Its presence on the menus of high-end restaurants and its reputation as a delicacy contribute to its high price point. The premium price for American sea bass also represents the efforts and costs of maintaining consistency and freshness. Suppliers often adhere to stringent quality control policies and sustainable fishing practices, which can raise production costs and ultimately influence pricing. The reputation of American sea bass as a gourmet fish plays a significant role in determining its price with factors such as perceived value, supply and demand dynamics, exclusivity, quality assurance, and the perception of superiority all contributing to its premium pricing in the market. Several factors, including transportation costs, also influence the price of American sea bass. American sea bass is primarily sourced from the Southern Ocean off Antarctica and the southern regions of South America, including Chile. The long distances transporting the fish to major markets worldwide, such as the United States, Europe, and Asia, result in significant costs. These costs include fuel, electricity, and logistics, which contribute to the overall price of the fish. Environmental factors affecting the availability and distribution of American sea bass include changes in water temperature and ocean currents, which can influence the availability and distribution of fish. These factors can affect fish behavior and migration patterns, which can influence catch rates and ultimately pricing. The price of American sea bass can also fluctuate depending on factors such as the size and quality of the fish. Due to their desirable taste and texture, larger, higher quality fish often fetch a premium price. In addition, factors such as freshness and finishing techniques can also influence pricing. Overfishing and illicit unreported, unregulated fishing practices have long sparked questions about sustainability and environmental impact. However, in recent years, attempts have been made to improve the sustainability of American sea bass fisheries by adopting stricter laws and monitoring strategies. Overfishing has recently been a significant issue in Chile, causing population declines and raising concerns about the long-term survival of American sea base and its impact on marine ecosystems. Illegal, unreported, and unregulated IEU fishing further threatens fish populations and degrades ecosystems. Bycatch and habitat damage are also concerns, as non-target species like seabirds and marine mammals are accidentally captured, and equipment such as bottom trawls and long lines damage fragile marine habitats. While strides have been made in the efforts to sustain American sea bass fisheries, significant challenges persist. Ongoing initiatives must focus on implementing effective conservation measures and fostering collaboration among various stakeholders. By working together, we can safeguard the future of this species and ensure sustainability for generations to come.
In summary, the high cost of American sea bass is a combination of its rich flavor, unique habitat, complex harvesting process, and stringent sustainability measures. As consumers, we play a vital role in supporting sustainable practices and ensuring this delicious fish remains available for future generations. So next time you see American sea bass on the menu, you'll know exactly why it's worth every penny. For now, let aside the controversy surrounding the hunting of wild boar. Surely you must be hungry? Let's head over here. Craving the ultimate American street food experience? The bacon double cheeseburger is where it's at. This bad boy is the epitome of indulgence, crafted with juicy beef patties, crispy bacon, and melted cheese, all nestled in a fresh bun. It's a classic that never gets old and keeps everyone coming back for more. American farmers put their heart and soul into raising the best beef, ensuring each bite is bite is packed with flavor. Bacon, often sourced from wild hogs or regular farm-raised pigs, adds that irresistible crunch and smoky taste. While food industry machines play a role in large-scale food production, nothing beats the charm of a handcrafted burger. This mouth-watering creation is a testament to American ingenuity, blending traditional cooking with modern convenience. It's like hunting for the perfect meal, a quest that brings you face to face with flavors as wild and satisfying as a giant wild boar. Whether you're imagining the thrill of hog hunting or just savoring the end result, this burger captures the essence of American street food culture. And while we respect the efficiency of food processing machines, sometimes the best bites come from the hands of a skilled cook. So next time you get a chance, grab a bacon double cheeseburger and taste a piece of American tradition. Imagine sitting down to a steaming bowl of American style giant beef noodles, a dish that's as comforting as it is hearty. This ain't your everyday noodle soup, it's a robust, mouth-watering experience that takes you right to the heart of America's culinary traditions. Perfect for those over 30 who appreciate the art of slow cooking and the depth of flavors that only come from homemade goodness. This dish is a testament to the hard work and dedication of American farmers. The beef used in these noodles is top-notch, sourced from cattle raised on the vast plains, ensuring each bite is packed with rich, savory flavor. The noodles, thick and chewy, are the perfect vehicle for soaking up the delicious broth, which simmers for hours to develop its complex taste. Though this recipe is made by hand, it pays homage to the food industry machines that make large-scale food production possible. These machines, essential in today's food industry, ensure that people across the country can enjoy high-quality meals conveniently. However, the essence of this dish lies in its traditional preparation, where patience and love for cooking shine through. For those who love a bit of adventure in their meals, imagine the rich flavor profile that could come from using wild boar instead of beef. Wild boar hunting is not just a pastime, but a way to control the invasive species population, helping maintain balance in nature. The hunt for these giant wild boars is as thrilling as the dishes they can create are delicious. Whether you're a fan of classic beef or intrigued by the robust taste of wild boar, 
These American-style giant beef noodles promise a meal that's both satisfying and memorable. It's a perfect blend of traditional cooking methods and the spirit of American ingenuity, all in one bowl. If you're walking down the streets of any bustling American city, chances are you'll come across a classic street food that always draws a crowd ring donuts. These sweet treats, a staple of American culture, are often handmade with care and skill, even in an era where food industry machines dominate. There's something magical about the process, from mixing the dough to frying it up until it's golden brown and deliciously crispy on the outside. Imagine the skilled hands of American farmers who not only grow the finest ingredients but also sometimes find themselves dealing with wild boars invading their crops. These farmers are the unsung heroes, providing us with the quality produce that makes our food so exceptional. Their work is just as important as the latest food processing machines that help bring our favorite foods to market. Ring donuts, though simple in concept, are a testament to the blend of tradition and innovation. While machines in the food industry have made it easier to mass produce food, the charm of a handmade donut remains unbeatable. The process involves a bit of artistry, something that machines, no matter how advanced, can't replicate. It's similar to the way hunting for wild boars requires skill and patience, much like crafting the perfect donut. For those unfamiliar, wild boar hunting is a challenge, akin to perfecting the art of donut making. Hunters track these invasive species, which can cause significant damage to farmlands, much like a chef meticulously monitors the temperature and timing when frying donuts to ensure they come out just right. This connection between the hunt and the kitchen highlights the blend of tradition and technology in both worlds. In America, where innovation meets tradition, both hunters and bakers find a common ground. The food industry machines might be there to assist, but it's the human touch that makes a ring donut special. Whether you're savoring a fresh donut on a cool morning or hearing tales of wild hogs and baboon hunting, there's an appreciation for the skill and dedication involved. Thanks so much for tuning in, folks. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to hit that like button and smash that subscribe for more content like this. Drop a comment saying top notch to show your love. Have an awesome day. This is the video we created, hoping to receive support and appreciation from you all. 